Hello everyone, this is Anubhuti from Sunsity.com. Welcome back to my channel and today we are going to review another skincare product. So today we are going to talk about the Ordinary Buffet Serum uh, or Buffet, however you like to call it. I like to uh, call it uh, Buffet. So this is basically a serum which is combination of multiple um, skincare technologies. Uh, like it contains 11 amino acids, it contains peptides, it contains probiotics and it contains hyaluronic acid. So it is supposed to make your skin nourished and it is supposed to work on uh, early signs of aging. Uh, with continu continuous usage, it is supposed to make uh, your look, skin look more plump, more healthy. Um, and also reduce the uh, appearance of fine lines and texture of the skin. So uh, yeah, without any further ado, uh, let's jump into the details if it does what it claims or not. Let's uh, first talk about the packaging. Um, the Ordinary Buffet Serum comes in a similar matte uh, glass bottle with white dropper packaging. The product is inside and the dropper is like this. The product itself is like hazy milky serum it has very good consistency as you can see and it is very lightweight it spreads easily and it's it gets absorbed into skin without leaving any shininess behind and i prefer to use uh, two to three drops on my face and my neck coming to the usage uh, the ordinary says you can use it AM or PM or AM PM both uh, but you have to keep in mind uh, that it this product because since it has peptides and so it has some contradictions which means it cannot be used with direct acids like AHAs, BHAs or vitamin C uh, like ascorbic acid or ascorbic acid. Uh, the only product uh, from vitamin C range which does not uh, conflict with this one is uh, ascorbyl glucoside solution 12% which I reviewed in a previous video. I will link that in the description box below in case you want to check it out. Uh, it is always recommended to do a patch test before using any skincare product on your face. So I did uh, both kinds of uh, patch tests, one behind the ear and inside my arm like ordinary suggests and I did not face any kind of irritation. So I started uh, incorporating this product um, every alternate day, uh, once in the morning. And one week went fine, then I started uh, a using it every day in my AM routine. Because in my PM routine, I like to use AHAs, BHAs sometimes, uh, so that is why I do not want to incorporate this in my PM routine. So I prefer to use it in the morning routine and on the days if I'm not using anything, uh, or any actives on my face, then I'm feeling my skin needs an extra, uh, uh, an extra nourishment, I like to use it in my PM routine as well. Now coming to the performance, this is one ordinary product which I thought did nothing for my skin and then I fell in love with it when I actually stopped using it. So um, I was using it and I felt it, it was doing nothing for my skin but in fact it was doing a lot. My skin was looking more plump, my skin was looking more healthier, my skin was, my texture was uh, reduced my uh, fine lines which are uh, under my eyes mostly and my smile lines um, they were less prominent so it was working and then um, when I recently st stopped using this one and I was using my face cream alone I noticed that my skin was not as hydrated as it was before so again I it's almost empty so again I used it one day uh, just to see uh, if it makes any difference and I went over uh, with same face cream which I'm using and my skin was suddenly feeling very very hydrated and then I realized yet it was doing so much for my skin coming to the summary it does work uh, it does what it claims to do. It did um, reduce the appearance of my fine lines and my laugh lines. And um, 
also my texture my pores everything was looking smoother my skin was looking smoother healthier and over the on top of that it was looking very plump it was very hydrated it was feeling very hydrated and because uh, this has hyaluronic acid in this one so then i think that was doing the job and because in pregnancy you can you know supposed to use retinols also co copper peptides you uh, so then I did some research and I, I found out that this was safe to use in the pregnancy. So I, I started using this one and I loved it. I do recommend if you want to start incorporating anti-aging products and you're too afraid to try retinol, then uh, yeah, this is a good product. This did not cause any kind of skin irritation on my sensitive skin and it, it did not cause any purging. And in fact, um, this helped uh, soothing the purging I had uh, because of the niacinamide I was using. So yeah, I definitely recommend this one. I absolutely love it and it's almost empty. It's like I was saving one drop of the product just for this review purpose. So yeah, I would like to purchase uh, this one in future as well. Um, since I'm breastfeeding, I still cannot use retinol. So I am planning to get a bigger bottle of this one because i i do love this one this does work and uh, this really did make a lot of difference in my skin and one more thing i want to put it out there that i'm no skincare guru or skincare enthusiast i just uh, am reviewing uh, these products uh, from my perspective i have super super sensitive skin uh, which is combination skin uh, which tends to get dry patches in the winters and oily patches in the summer but whatever works for everybody not, might not work for me because i have super sensitive skin and i did my own research before buying so uh, still uh, my skin is sensitive to one ingredient your skin might be sensitive to others so uh, keep that in mind uh, but anyways i absolutely love this product uh, i did uh, purchase the ordinary niacinamide ascorbyl glucoside solution 12% and the buffet and also uh, their AHA toning solution uh, out of all the products I was using out of these four products this is my favorite this is my absolute favorite and I'm absolutely going to repurchase this one so that's all from my side uh, if you liked the video give it a thumbs up do not forget to subscribe to my channel and if you would like to see more such videos leave it in the comment section below and uh, till next time bye bye